Welcome to Staking House, everybody. Today is a celebration day. Today we are celebrating 100 subscribers. Yeah, and that happened 24 hours, something like this. So thank you so much. Thank you very much. You were able to help me out with having a, a, a name for the channel. Before 100 subscribers, you don't have the option to, to put your name on the channel. So you have a number. So now it's youtube.com slash Staking House. So that it is. Thank you so much for all your support on this first days of the channel. So to celebrate this, a short ribs in the sous vide. And yesterday I put it on the sous vide and it's there for 18 hours. It was in 185 degrees Fahrenheit. And I wasn't planning on, on, on doing that today, but because of this special occasion, I decided to, why not? It was seasoned with smoked salt, smoked paprika, garlic powder, black pepper, and yeah, that was it. And I'm excited to see the result, guys. So celebrate with me. And I've said I'm gonna take the short ribs out of the sous vide. So for today's cook, I'm gonna sear in the oven. It's preheated and I'm going actually to broil it. So I just preheat it at 350 degrees and when I put inside I'm gonna turn off the, the, the oven and turn on the broil. This broth is fantastic. Super smoky. Wow! <laughs> the smell is just amazing! I'm gonna try to not take it off the bone, at least not for now, because it's already falling apart. As you can see, try to keep it together. Is no, oh, God. Okay, okay. Wait, not now. It's super beautiful, guys. Well, thanks for the hundred subscribers, so I can, you know, have the inspiration to do this one. This is on you. So I'm gonna pat it dry. Leave it here. Just for a minute. It's time for the broiling. And I'm gonna set the timer for 10 minutes. So, Alexa, set the timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, turn now. To go with the short ribs, I decided to create a new thing. So I got mashed potatoes and I added some spices. So for this one, what I wanted was a smoky flavor. So I, on top of the, the mashed potatoes, I added smoked salt, smoked paprika, and I added my charcoal smoked olive oil. And guys, this is fantastic. I, I wasn't expecting such a strong, punchy smoke flavor. So, what I'm gonna do, because flavor is never enough, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna mix in here a little bit of the juices from my cooking. And I wanna see how punchy it's gonna get. If it gets good, I'm gonna add a little bit on the whole thing. Wow, it's very interesting. Let me try the, the other one by itself. It's already have this, this orange color, this orange hue to that, because, because of the paprika. Hmm. It's very interesting because here you have like a punchy flavor very smoky, but the flavor of the mashed potatoes is still here pretty much. 
He's rather one in the other hand. The flavor from the juices steals a little bit of the flavor of the potatoes. It is very good, but I think I like the mashed potatoes better without the without the juice. I wasn't expecting this. Now it's time, guys. I hope you guys can can hear the smell. Can you hear it? The smell? It's still sizzling, guys. This is beautiful. <laughs> this is beautiful. Wow, man. Wow. And yes, I did. Almost. It broke right in the end. You saw that. So this is it, guys. This is all for me because my wife is already in Brazil waiting for me there. Baby, I know you're waiting for me and now you're watching this and saying, whoa, I gotta have some ribs here. Her father make a fantastic, fantastic rib. Dude, I actually do this. I am thinking about his ribs. Thank you, Sonny Valdo. Your ribs is just amazing. Wow. Wow. Just to feel, wow. I can finish the video now, guys. There's nothing to say. It's super, super fantastic. Wow. The broil for this is super, 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 super good. I've done this with the, the cooking torch before and turns out very good, but the broil is really much better. I think you guys can see it. Rib a little bit overcooked on the outside, but I mean for a short ribs, it's kind of perfect in my opinion. It's crunchy, super flavorful, baby, I wish you were here to try this one. I'm gonna test now this with a little bit of the smoky mashed potatoes. I'm put them together. Mm. Mm. Wow. This reminds me of Hatatouille and he eats the strawberry with cheese together and pops a lot of incredible graphics around him because of the mix of the flavor, it is exactly what I'm seeing now. <laughs> yeah, thank you Ratatouille for putting these in visuals. Every time something like this happens, I remember the movie. Love this movie. Love Pixar. Who doesn't? And I work with animation, so yeah. All right, guys. I gotta keep eating this. And thank you for being one of my first subscribers. And that's the beginning of the channel. So thank you again. And if you like this video, please leave a thumbs up, share this video with your friends, turn the notifications on, and I see you guys in the next one. Mm -hmm.